<laughs> well, it's just part of the biorhythm thing, right? So, and it'll, it'll, what we do is we, we try and balance this out before we go into the program because the biorhythms are always changing and we don't want to have that interfere with the rest of the program. So we're, we're going to try and balance that out right now and get a general perspective of what's going, what's going on. Yeah. Okay, so this is something that didn't come up on you. It wasn't an issue, but, uh, I mean, it's not that it's actually an issue or not, but, uh, okay, so you know about, uh, do you know about ech echinacea? Uh, have you ever heard of, uh, yeah, echinacea, yeah. have you ever heard of reishi mushroom? No. Okay, reishi mushroom, and then there's also cordyceps mushroom. It helps to, uh, nourish the immune system. So, these are the kind of things... And raw carrots are really good for your immune system too. So these are the things that can help because it's showing you have a little bit of immune system um, related stress. So anything you can do to help balance your immune system energy would be good. And so right now we're just adjusting the computer to your body. And so it takes a minute or a couple minutes here. And then we'll test your body into certain substances, and then that'll take another couple minutes first, and then we can go into the therapy. Okay, so now we're calibrating. So we're going to calibrate your reaction so that we don't send too much energy into your body when we do the therapies. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to find your happy medium here so that it doesn't overstimulate you. So what you need to do is you need to take a deep breath and completely relax. Uh. She shut it down. She shut it down. Why so, did I do that? I don't know. Maybe there's a mental, you have a mental, something mental is coming up. Okay, let's try it again. Take a deep it, breath and then relax. This is only the second time this has happened. This is the second time this has happened. I've been doing this like, I haven't done a lot. I've done like maybe, maybe a hundred clients. This is only the second time it's happened. So it, you saying I took a deep breath and when I let it out? No, no, you, it happened before that. It, it's like you were saying you you have that anxiety about yeah, the test. Yeah. So that's maybe that may be the reason why I did that. Yeah. So yeah, because no, I I know what you're saying about tests. I took quite a few of them in school, and I a lot of anxiety there. Yeah, it's funny. I don't know why it should be. Well, that's not something that I ever had. No, I know you said that. Anxiety not, over you tests. Like, well, you know, I've always had a problem I with know. that. So, uh, yeah, you just, you have to, well, what I want you to do is I want you to focus on your breath right now and then just think about inhaling and exhaling. Because <laughs> yeah, you get too locked in your head, it's like that, that, it's like your body puts up a blockage to it, you know, so. Just relax. Dude. Yeah. Welcome to the Quantum Zero. Yeah, it's not. You'll probably not feel anything. You probably won't feel any pain or anything. What normally people do is they'll feel it after each vertebrae and a stress related to it and provide therapy. So what it's doing right now is scanning your spine. So it'll scan your spine and tell us which vertebrae are stressed and or subluxed or um, inflamed. Do you know which ones? I did. Let, let me let me let me tell you and see if this if this jives. It'll take about another minute or so. See, no. Well, the recent one is I think like the one before was not interesting. Yeah. Um, okay. Here's here's what it came up with. It came up with the cervical. Let's see, uh, there's one in the cervical, which is, the cervical is the neck, right? Yeah. Okay, so this is cervical, uh, C, 
five. So the circle of C5, that's the one down here, kind of like when your neck connects to your shoulders. And it's showing some stress, so what we're going to do is we're going to add a little electrophysiological therapy and see if we can do anything for that. Now, the next one is, and what I normally do is that C5, field sensor imagine, energy going into that area, or white light or whatever you want to do, or healing. As I... Uh, talk about it. And so the next one is going to be the thoracic, which is the T1. The T1 is right below the C5. So that's the next one down. So you said it was C5 <coughs> and T1. Yeah. I think it was lower down that Margaret uh, had the problem. Yeah, well let's see. We're going down the line here. Uh, so the next one is Going down the line is T7, which is right about right about there. That's where your ribs and so stomach are. Kind of C area. C7. I thought C7 was in your neck. Oh, excuse me, T7. T7. Yeah. So field sensor, imagine that vertebrae in good alignment, and or being healed or energy going into it. And then also the T8, which is a little bit below that. Field sensor, imagine a spine in, in alignment and having excellent improvement. Now, oh, okay, so then the next one down is going to be the T9. The T9 is just above your belly button. Field sensor, imagine energy going into there, white light or healing energy. So that indicates to me, I mean, uh, the thing about the, the, the thing about the chiropractic is that this exercise we do is really good for that. And so it's hard for me to recommend any other exercise, you know. Yeah, what do you mean, follow that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really good for your spine. I actually, did I tell you I had my my back go out? You had your back? I had my back go out. This was like several years ago. Oh. And uh, you're talking about exercise two. Yeah. yeah. So we start yeah. there, we go down there, we go up there and down there, and each one of those is held for several minutes. Yeah. Okay. Let's talk about the lumbar. So the lumbar. Lumbar two. Uh, so the lumbar two. The lumbar two is right about near the bottom, I think. Yeah. So feel, sense, or imagine. Healing energy going into that area. But anyway, I had my back go out, and the doctor, the chiropractor said, You have to come in once a year, uh, once a month to have an adjustment, otherwise, you'll keep having the problem. And I kept, I kept doing the, this exercise one day when I was doing it, and in pain from my back, my back snapped back in place. <laughs>